So after the previous video where we took a look at uh, probably the worst antenna that uh, we've looked at on this channel, um, I was thinking whether a uh, omnidirectional, a good omnidirectional antenna would be of uh, benefit to uh, FPV. Now, some of you who have been around for quite a while will know I don't fly myself, but I've seen plenty of videos on YouTube where people have got the headset on and they're flying quite close up uh, to themselves and not waiting for any kind of distance. But uh, because they've got the headset on, they're not tracking it by uh, looking directly at the quadcopter. So a nomidirectional antenna would uh, work perfectly in that situation. So I thought, uh, you know, if it would be of use, I could do a video on uh, making a uh, a decent uh, around 5 dB gain omnidirectional antenna for FPV at 5.8 gigahertz. Now, as an example here, I've got uh, one of these uh, little rubber ducky Wi-Fi. Uh, antennas on my alpha card here and I am trying to connect to a uh, Wi-Fi repeater that is at the uh, front of my house. I am quite a distance from my house here in the lab and we've also got to go through quite a few uh, brick walls but let me put my hand behind it and uh, see if we can connect to it again. There you go. So when I do connect to it I'm getting around 50% not good enough to connect to the internet because it drops out all the time but uh, basically I'm going to replace it with this one here that I designed uh, for Wi-Fi some time ago where I was playing around with the loading calls because I wanted to make a uh, decent dB antenna but have it much shorter than normal but if I put this on you can see the difference in uh, gain that you can get So we'll just let that load up and you can see straight away we're getting well over 10 dB of gain, probably uh, 15 dB, definitely uh, around 65% there. Uh, now that it's settling down, maybe just above 60, but uh, definitely no dropouts whatsoever. So you could connect to the internet with that, no problem at all, and it wouldn't be dropping out. So let me know if you think uh, an antenna like this would be useful for uh, FPV because I've hunted around the internet trying to find something similar and I just can't find anything that's been made or if you you know you you, you do know where I can find one that has been made uh, show me a link and I'll uh, take a look at it but uh, if you want me to show you how to make one of these uh, uh, slightly longer range uh, dipole antennas then uh, just drop a comment below and uh, I'll see what we can do and you know hopefully it'll be a future video